welcome to the Leaves Podcast. Today we're going to be counting leaves. Sir, can I please go? I have to be somewhere. Just for that comment, Reese. And stay for an extra 20 minutes. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Now I'm never going to make it. Stuff this. Dude, I don't think I'm gonna make it. I'm late. The teacher was a nugget. I got you, bro. Send me your location. How long will it take me to get home? Hold up. I'll connect you to Kara. Hi, Reese. I'm here to help. In terms of navigation, we can use the A-star search algorithm to interpret roads as nodes, the heuristic being the distance from the current location to home. To find the least expensive node, we have to look through the open list. Once found, move it to the closed list. If it is not walkable, ignore it. We can use this method to find the lowest cost route to the final destination. If you push it, it'll take you 3 minutes and 36 seconds to make it home. I sent the route to your watch. Better get a move on then. Gosh, how hard do I need a pedal? Calculating. To travel at 15 km per hour up a 17.6% or 10 degree slope, you must sustain approximately 544 watts grease. What does that mean? My heart hurts. Just pedal harder. Kara, call me an Uber. There's one waiting for you already. Oh, you're the best. You, Ruiz? Yep. Yara Kara, yeah? Yep. Oh. We're getting on on fuel. We should be right, though. Kara, could you please check that for me? Sure thing, Reese. With 0.26 litres of fuel, you can travel at 60 kilometres per hour for 2 minutes and 58 seconds. The car will now stop approximately in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. How'd you know that was gonna happen? Kara, how am I gonna make it? I've only got... 10 minutes, Reese. Scanning, there is a boat not far from your location that will get you there in time. How can I run faster? Analyzing your weight and technique, you are running at an average of 64.4% efficiency. To improve your running efficiency, push harder off the ground, lean forward, land with your toes and decrease your knee flexion to 125 degrees. Hey Kara, what's the fastest way there? Drift is headed northwest on a 45 degree angle. To overcome this, we must set a heading of 100 degrees. To find the resultant speed we can use the sign rule. Resultant course is due east. Resultant speed is 28.4 knots. To accommodate for this loss of speed, you must travel at 43 knots, so the resultant speed becomes 35 knots. Finally, how late am I? You're just on time. Nice! Hey, Karen! So getting here was easy? Yeah, a breeze. 